Morning everyone. I'm working on a uh, 92 LS400 on your ZFE. Now this car recently uh, had a cam done by someone else. And I'm pulling it apart because the cam sensor wire was rubbing on the on the accessory belt, which was a bit of a problem. Also done an exhaust manifold and a few other bits and pieces, but I'm just gonna talk about the rotors. Now the garage pulled this car apart, placed the cam out, looks like they've done tensioners and looks like they've done a water pump. They didn't do the rotors. And you see here, there's a big crack there. Up around the edge here is falling to pieces, it's cracking. Can't really see it, can we get in there? Oh, yeah, we see a bit of the crack there. And on this side, big crack. The distributor cap, I couldn't actually get the coil lead out and the end of the coil lead is stuck. In the end, it's all corroded and ugly and horrible. Um, inside, there's corrosion and crap happening inside, which is pretty normal. So, when you're doing a cam battle on one of these, it really pays to put uh, at least new rotors in it, and often caps, so I, I keep caps in stock, distributor cap, brand new, genuine Toyota, and the same as the ignition rotors. Um, do them before they fall apart, I change a lot because these cars have got misfires or other issues, so I change them then, but every time I do a cam battle on an early one, I pretty much always do rotors, and about 50% of the time I, I do the distributor cap, so when you're doing it, do that, keep up with your maintenance properly, car will run a bit uh, nicer for a bit longer. So um, contact the car tune company, we've got those parts in stock most of the time. So I hope that's helpful, and we'll talk to you again.